Hello everybody, welcome back to the void. I'm player one, by myself. They uh, they got him. Yeah, he's not here right now. Um, so I have to find stuff to do. And uh, I decided, you know what? We're just gonna get absolutely cracked in Xenoblade. So, I'm gonna do literally as much as I can do before the boss. And so, the first thing I decided was to do those last unique monsters where we needed to get it to be raining. So, I have done that. And we're doing the first one, which is Napping Volfin, which is right over here on Gower Plain. And I'm also doing something maybe a little weird. I am Sharla. The reason? Well, really, it's just because I haven't, haven't played this yet, so... Now, I'll be honest, if I didn't explicitly go out of my way to play as her, yeah, we probably won't play as her. Because I don't think... Don't think either of our playstyles would work with Sharla. She just kind of hangs back and yeah. But, you know, it, it is good to, to use all of your, your party members, just to at least know how they work. There's, there's that guy. So now, you might think, oh, you go to the next one, right? Well, no, because this isn't thunderstorm. This is just regular rain. And I need to get it to thunderstorm in order to go fight white eduardo so i will be back when we get to him and i got it there he is let's get this done and dusted this won't take long don't get careless guys monsters here so now I'm going to do quests um I'm gonna go to colony 9 and I'm going to start doing all the quests Ready do this one. Mm -hmm. 
All right. didn't realize we already had ones that were just done. We just had to send them in. Hello. Alright. Right, my curry ain't gonna be famous, it's gonna be infamous. It's life or death, mate. My curry's cream ingredient is dance apples. They give it the flavor, but my supplies almost run out. Problem is, I'm too busy here to go and get it. You can't stop making it. I'd die if I couldn't eat your curry. Plus, you don't charge extra for a bigger helping. You really like my curry? Well, thanks, mate. So, you don't mind helping me out? I'll make it worth your while. Alright. We need apples. So I guess just gotta collect those. What is this one? You like solving problems, don't you? Well, I've got a whopper. I broke my mom's pendant. She loves it so much, Dad gave her it. Now mom's super angry and she's making horrible mush for dinner. If I don't eat some real food and fast, my tongue's gonna fall off. I've tried to find someone who can fix my mom's pendant, but no one in the residential district can do it. I can't walk very far on my own, so can you find someone instead? I think Dean should be able to help. He works at the lab. Really? Thanks, Shulk. Does that mean you're asking for me? Uh, yeah. And he's just, he's just back here. Oh, yeah, you have to have to be shulk. Hi there. All right. Rocco. That name sounds familiar. Isn't he Sonia's little boy? Yeah, that's him. Make sure you say that it was me who fixed it. That's all the things I need. Okay. Hmm. Hello. 
You got it fixed. Wow, you really did it. It's just like it was before. Who fixed it? Dean from the lab? This Dean guy must be pretty awesome. When I grow up, I will be able to fix things just like him. Alright. What is this one over here? Oh, uh, yeah, this one. We already almost finished this one without even trying. Please, you must listen. My son went missing years ago, and I think I know where he went. I found something that belonged to him. That's how I know he's... He's gone. He's gone, and he's never coming back. And worst of all, I don't even have his remains to return to the Bionis. Could you find his other effects? I'd like to know how far he went. You can count on me, old lady. Is that so? Do I look like someone who'd make jokes? It's nice to see there are so fine upstanding youths in the world. You remind me of my son. My son said he was aiming to reach the Bionis head, silly boy. I don't know how far he got, but I'd like it if you found his effects. Yeah, we already found two of the things. We literally just need the last one. Thank you most kindly. Accepting my son's fate was hard, but it's left me much more at ease. Take care in your own travels. Uh huh. I I want to make sure I'm Charlotte because this is probably going to be the easiest way we get affinity for her, since we're probably not going to play as her much. All right. Uh, what else? What else? Why are all the apples so scattered? Bean. Hi there. Remember how I did you a favor by fixing that pendant? Well, I need to call in that favor. I'm sure you know what this is about. How should I put this? Basically, I want to have a date, ahem, I mean dinner, with Sonya. I'm too embarrassed to ask her myself after all these years. Surely you can help me out if I fix that pendant for you. This might sound rude, but isn't it a bit sad getting us to ask her? Oh, how odd. You remind me of Sonya. Have we met before? Not interested, mister. Get back to why we're here. Please, uh, you're mistaken. I never meant it like that. Uh, back to the topic at hand. Will you help me? Okay. I don't mind how you do it. Just ask her after dinner for me. Alright, you weirdo. I'm gonna go get this one up here. Are you the interfering do-gooder everyone's been talking about? I've got a big favor to ask you. Could you find Miller for me? He's a habitual slacker, and I just don't know what to do with him. He always runs away as soon as he sees me coming. I haven't so much as spoken a word to him lately. He's the only subordinate I have, so I can't just ignore him. Good to see our young captain hasn't changed. Ryan, you look like you need some work. Surely you can help me out. You asking for help again? You have to do this stuff yourself sometimes. I know, but you know how fast Miller can run, don't you? He can get away from me in three seconds. I need your help. Alright. Well, I know where Miller is.
Captain Leader wants me to go back, does she? What is it with that woman? Can't she come find me herself? Anyway, I don't want to make any trouble for you. I'll go back. Guess while we're here, talk to Sodium. Hi there. Oh, Dean wants to go to dinner. <laughs> How cute of him to say that. To be honest, I'd love to say yes, but the problem is the kids. I can barely find time for myself because they squabble constantly. It's such a silly argument as well. It's all because of a Shin Gecko. Shin Geckos are rare, you see. And before I knew it, they started arguing over who spotted it first. And while the argument raged on, the Shin Gecko ran off scared. Maybe if they could each have one as a pet, they'd calm down a bit. Then I'd feel happy inviting Dean over for dinner. Damn. I need one more. Such a tragedy, I suppose it can't be helped. How kind of you to stop and listen. All the flowers in my garden got crushed in the attack. I worked so hard to grow them, but now it saddens me to look at them. I know what it feels like to lose something important. You know, you lost your flowers, I lost my girlfriend. It's the same thing, really. I hope there's something we can do to help. talk to you. It's serious. Me and Paula had this big public falling out. It's so embarrassing. It was about Ryan and you. It's silly, really. We argued about who's the strongest and hottest. I told her it was you, obviously. No need to worry about that. But now I need you to go and kill a dragon for me. And alone. Are you stupid or something? Ryan is loads cooler. You're the stupid one. Shulk's way better and cuter. Well, Ryan's hotter and stronger. Ryan's got a small brain. Ryan's just as clever as Shulk. Well, well, Shulk's kinder. Anyway, Ryan's big and scared. Ryan can protect me. Nothing can hurt me as long as Ryan's around. When has Ryan ever had to protect you? Well, you bet you don't even know Shulk mended my toy for me once. I can't believe you just said that. <laughs> Gonna cry now, you cry baby. Uh, I, I, I don't know. It'll probably just make things worse between you guys. Oh, please, Shulk, please. My street cred will be ruined if you don't. Everyone will laugh at me. Me and Ryan never argue. Can't you two be more like us? I guess we could be. I'll promise to make up with Paolo if you promise me something. Show us that you really are best friends forever. Uh-huh, and, and here it is. Here is the quest that goes on for a good long, 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 long time, and we will not finish it for a good, good, long, long time. And you want to know why? Well, we have to get uh, Shulk and Ryan to... What is it? Oh yeah, no, we, we got them to blue, so we can do this step. Wow, you and Ryan are the bestest of friends. I've changed my mind about Ryan. I can see he's a nice boy too. But now you gotta prove to Paola about your friendship. And she won't believe you unless you really are the bestest friends. And what that means is, you gotta get up to the next affinity level. But but you're not you're not done after that. Then after that, Paola was like, well I wonder if girls can be like that. And then you have to do 
the same affinity level, but between girls. We only have one girl in the party right now. You wanna know when we get the next girl? A long time. And then we have to get them to a high affinity. This quest is... it takes so long. Just because you have to go through a lot of the game in order to even have the possibility of doing it. So yes. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's you. Never mind. I think all the quests are just collecting now? I'm pretty sure. But, yeah? uh -huh. Oh, no, this one, yeah. Excellent job. I was right to trust you with this. Melo's learned his lesson and promised not to slack off again. Until now, bad luck's kept me from achieving my dream. Now I can finally move forward. Thank you. you again. Good timing. I've got a little job for you. The number of wind vangs in Tefra Cave has really shot up. None of the other teams are willing to exterminate them, so it falls to my platoon to take on the job. Only thing is, me and Miller can't handle it alone. I was hoping you could help out. I want you to man Tefra Cave. Kill five just to make sure. Can I count on you? Here we are again. And let me guess, you have to take all the credit for our work. I'll make sure everyone knows you helped us. But if you're still not happy, I know, I'll buy you dinner. You can stuff yourself with all your favorite foods. Now that's what I'm talking about. Alright, and I think that may be all the ones on the map right now. Let me change the time. I'm not going to accept this one just yet, uh, because we don't have the party member who comments on it. Uh, so yeah. Now let me see that nighttime. I'm used to being in debt, but never this badly. I'll never be able to pay the whole lot back. And the total keeps growing bigger and bigger and bigger. The worst part is it's affecting my ability to write anything decent, so I barely have any kind of cash flow coming in at all. Listen here, sonny. You better pay me back. 300,000 G in two days. You do realize what'll happen to you if you don't pay, right? But you can't. We agreed on two months. I can't get it that quickly. Well, the deal's changed. If you don't pay up, I'm gonna seize everything you owe. The bloke who lent me the money is really turning the screws. I don't know what I can do, but I have to keep up payments somehow. Oh. Oh, Lone Shark. Mm-mm. Oh, this is a good one. But have to be Shulk to accept it. Hello. Oh, Shulk, there you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. 
I've broken my watch. Look, it's in pieces. I'm terrible with machines, even little ones like this. Would you mind fixing it for me? You don't have to be good with machines to be careful with them. You just have to be careful. Wasn't your father good with machines? I'd have thought fixing things would be the first thing he'd teach you. Not just good, he was amazing. When I was little, I used to marvel at how he swung that hammer. But he's gone now, and as hard as I try, I can't be like he was. Uh, I'm... I'm sorry, Desiree. I didn't mean to be rude. Aw, oh, it's so easy to make you go all timid. Seriously, don't worry about it. It's been a year since then. I'm back on my feet. Anyway, are you going to fix my watch or not? It's in pretty bad shape. I'll have to use the equipment in the lab, so it might take a while. Alright. What is this one over here? Oh, it's... it's the meeting. And we don't have the party member. Okay. I have my list right here, just to make sure I don't mess up. Okay, that might be everything. I think now, what I have to do is just go out and do stuff. rank are we? Two stars. Okay. Alright. Well, I think with that, we'll end it there. I accepted a whole lot. I did a few. But next, we're going to do a whole lot. I've been Player One, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.